Hello everyone, welcome to Prosumer Lab 101, where we introduce and test amazing products that have a power to change the world. At Prosumer Lab 101, we are testing and analyzing outstanding products that are receiving rave reviews. We have another stunning product today, so please stay with us. Let me introduce our researchers. Our perfect analyst, Ilya. Welcome. Hello everyone, my name is Ilya, and welcome back to Prosumer Lab 101. And our lamb mascot, please ask away as always, Amy. Kimchi! <laughs> Thanks again for having me back. Good to be here. I'm here for you. <laughs> and our today's special product examiner, John, who is a tall and very handsome. Welcome. <laughs> Thank you for having me. Hi, I'm John. Mm. I think John was uh, brought up in the studio a little bit. Maybe our viewers, our female viewers, probably love it. Oh, really? <laughs> that's, that's great to they know. Probably, yeah. Yeah. Uh, so Can I'm you? from Germany uh -huh. uh, and Korea. So my mom is Korean, my dad is German. Mm -hmm. And um, yes, in Korea, I've been now around four years. I work as a model, a DJ, uh -huh. and in TV. And I also work at a company. Good. Mm -hmm. So uh, <laughs> I know. Yeah, and Amy yeah. know John before? He's my best friend. Ah, yeah. okay, so you know him a lot, then you can guess what today's product is. Well, he's a bit of a mixed bag in all honesty. <laughs> you never know what's up his sleeve because he does do so many different things. So uh -huh. it could be like a music thing, he's really into music. It could be uh, fashion, he's really into fashion. Could be... It can be anything, yeah, because I know John personally too, and he's a really hard-working guy. Mm. So yeah, it can be anything. Mm. So hard-working German guy John, what he will present to us. Oh yeah, oh, that's, that's very so, curious. Uh, I know that he was working for the uh, German car company. Yes, that's so correct. So maybe it's, it's something related to cars. Well, it is not a car, but it's related to cars. Related mm -hmm. okay. to cars. It's got to be some like tuning or something because you combine like cars with your other love of like clubbing and music and DJing. What if it's like tuning the cars, like pimp your ride? Car audio. Oh car audio. That's well, so the internet. Such an Amy thing to say. Yeah. <laughs> but, Are but, you typecasting me? <laughs> but on. sadly not true. Sadly not true. Okay. Well, maybe, I don't want to be here then. Maybe it has to do something with IoT technology as well as we always have products related to IoT. IoT, right? Mm -hmm. So maybe it's something in that area. Could be. But before revealing today's product, let's talk about the cars a more a little bit. Okay. Uh, what is uh, one product that have a that made human life so different? Maybe. Uh, in my perspective, that's a car. It's got to be cars. Mm -hmm. Can you imagine? Like, what did we even do before? The, the horse and buggy? That would have <laughs> exactly. taken forever. Yeah. Pretty much. Yeah. So um, here we have John here, who is a also German, yes. and German is the capital of the car. Well, yeah, of course, like uh, all the luxury cars you know are probably made all in Germany, pretty much. Really? Like, if you look at all the brands, yeah, like mm -hmm. pretty much yeah, the pretty big much ones are all there. Yeah. Like all the really luxury ones. Yeah. yeah. So is that what it's like in Germany? You just go around, just like luxury cars everywhere? I think I need to take a little trip. <laughs> <laughs> well, Amy, I can tell you, it is like that, but not necessarily. Oh, oh, no. oh you yes. got me so, there! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, basically what it is, in uh, Germany you have a really big culture for luxury cars, but also what you have is a culture for caring for your car. Ah. So, new is not always better. Uh -huh. People like to buy a car and take care of it for like 10, 20 years. Mm. And to do that, you need the right product. So, hint, something hint. related to maintain, oh. make, like maintain your car, mm. to take care of your car. Is that? Right? Yes, exactly. It is a product that helps you take care of your car and um, yeah, let you enjoy the car for a very long time. Okay. Yeah. Okay, today's product is a special product to maintain your car. Okay, here we're revealing it. Three, two, one, let's go! Bye bye! It looks like a liquid. Is it a car? It's soap? supposed to be liquid because it's spray. It looks like cosmetics for cars or yeah, something it's like it's that. Like a is it like a little cars. flash? You maybe like? Mm. Yeah, it does look very fancy, right? So basically, what it is, I reveal, <laughs> is hmm. a coating agent for cars. So oh, okay. you can basically do the coating for your car yourself. You don't have to go to the shop anymore. Uh, excuse huh. me, me? 
<laughs> I don't do that kind of stuff. I, I don't even know how to touch a car, well, you, but like I could actually do it. You can call your taxi. <laughs> <laughs> Recently, so many products are related to the cars was invented, like uh, to, to carry the umbrellas, the shoe racks in yeah. the cars. Mm. People spend a lot of time in the car, right. so it's yeah. really convenient to have that mm. kind of stuff. Or like the tray tables, right. you know what I mean? Mm. Like you can right. have full on business class in the back of your car if you right. wanted to. In a small size of refrigerator sometimes. Yeah. Oh, so nice though, so nice. <laughs> so even more reason to take good care of your beloved car. So you do the car wash often? Um, usually like no, once every two, three weeks. Pretty much. That's every two, three weeks. Mm, yeah. okay, that's you know, awesome, when yeah. my family came here to visit me in Korea, mm. that was one thing they were actually really impressed by was how clean all of the cars are. Because that's you know, true. like in Russia, it's probably the same. Yeah. There's so much snow right. and salt on the roads mm. from to protect people from the ice. So our cars get right. really dirty yeah. all the time. So you're saying that this will prevent that from happening. Absolutely, especially the snow part, because one of the amazing features of this product is the water repellence feature. Oh. So it really helps to, it gives like the car a special coating. So when there's a lot of rain or there's a lot of snow or even hail, the coating will help to prevent the water on like splashing down on the car and kind of makes it just like float away. You know? mm. It's like, like an like X-Man spray. Exactly, because usually when you call the car and the rain goes, it's like it gives like definite you know, like it, you watermarks, can, points, like watermarks. Ah, you can yeah. actually see the water hitting the car. Mm. What about this one? Okay, since uh, Johnny keeps saying that this, how great this product is, mm -hmm. John prepared a short video. Let's see the video. Mm. Oh, it's a nice, nice car, car. John. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> my puppy. <laughs> my puppy. Is that the name of your car? Uh, yeah. You call her my puppy? Uh, oh. <laughs> I call it many names. Yeah, rainy day. Yeah. yeah. You know that trouble. Yeah. It's like recent in Korea. That it happens rains a lot. heavily. Yeah, it rains heavily right now in this season. Oh, oh the sauna. It's oh, so yeah. hot. Yeah, inside. it's, it's yeah. really hot. Yeah, with all the. Uh, it happens to hail. It hails every day in Canada. Oh, is it really? Yeah. Oh, does it hail a lot in Canada? Yeah, we get hail for sure. Oh, okay. Ah! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's unfortunate. Oh, yeah. So basically, all these things coming together, you are, you just get depressed, you know. So you right, need to do something right, about that. Right. So one of the uh, features of this product, as I said before, is the water repellency. So it really helps with this kind of product. And also another feature is uh, when you get hail or something like that, the coating helps to protect the car so there's not a scratch. So wow. that's still unbelievable parts. This one coating agent can prevent from the any weather things coming out? Exactly. Wow. Cool. wow. So that's uh, not only in Korea, but in Russia or in Canada, you can use it well. Absolutely. Because you guys as a country as soon as a lot. Well, mm. yeah, I'm sure in Canada it's the same problem, but uh, in Russia, especially in the winter season, it's mm. like every Every time you have to warm up your car because mm. it's too cold, you have to warm up the engine. And because of the snow and the differences of the temperature outside mm. and inside the engine, you know, like do you can mm. come up the car or... So yeah. it protects it from the ice as well because that's the worst thing about driving in Canada when you have to go outside, it's freezing it's cold. Freezing. You have to scrape mm. the ice off of the windshield. Mm. Oh, yeah. right, right. So right. it wouldn't let the water sit on the windshield so, so the ice wouldn't form, right? Yeah, basically what it is, yeah. is uh, if, you, if you look at that, like you have like the, that's the bonnet of the car, right? Uh -huh. So usually when you have ice or rain, it directly hits the bonnet mm. and it will like just stain it Stain it. Yeah, yeah, exactly. But if you have this protective yeah. layer of coating in between, yeah. it mm. kind of has this function as a puffer zone between like the mm. snow, the rain and whatever comes from outside and the actual bonnet. Okay. So that is why it makes it easier to actually scrape it off and like wow. clean it faster oh. and stuff like that. So that we can say about water wow. repelling coat? Exactly. Wow. Mm. That's good. Amazing. So it prevents dirt from the car and uh, what else is good about it? <gasps> Another amazing feature of this product uh -huh. is that it makes your car shine like no Ooh. time before. Wow. So, you know, the the great thing about like a polish is uh, that like it makes your car really bling bling and very nice and mm. I know mm. Amy you like it especially right mm. so well, she yeah. blings right now she can use her fingernail yeah. can you put it on my fingernail <laughs> like bling 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 bling, bling, bling. <laughs>
So yeah, that's uh, the two great features of this product. It makes your car really shiny and clean, and also helps uh, with the water repellency. Yeah. Wow. But I you like know, in like a right away. yellow dust season, right? Oh, right. Yeah. I think Spring this would time. be great for mm. that. Okay, so we can call that DIY product, DIY Rich. coating. So um, how to use it? Let's watch the video. Here comes the rain, rain again. Rain and hail, right? Mm -hmm. And poop. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. Okay, okay, wash the car clean. Yes. Okay. And step one. Then we you dry it off. Water. We mop it off. Mm -hmm. And then and you then use the spray. We, so we ah. just spray it on a car? Yes, pretty much. So spray it on the car. Can you spray like, it on a window? Yes, of course. Okay. So you can use it for glass, you can use it for the tires, you can use it for the frames. And then you just rub it in. Oh, mm, rubbing it real good. Oh, on the tires as well, exactly. it works. Because, like, you know, usually when you use the home appliance, like detergents and mm -hmm. stuff, you use different ones for different purposes, mm. right? The ones for the bathroom, the ones for the bedroom, mm. the ones for the kitchenware, yes. whatever. What about this car? Can you use it, like, for everything? Well, as you see in front of us, we have a little bit of a variety of products. Mm -hmm. So, the most general one is the, the black one right there. Mm -hmm. So, this is what you use uh, for the whole entire car. And uh, I think for the glass, you can can use it as well, but there's also like a speciality kind of product uh, just in mm. front there as well. Oh. And uh, the other thing is you also have like this kind of, uh, what do you call it, a sponge. So, mm. you know, while you use like a cloth to dry off the bonnet after you spray the product on it, mm. uh, for the glass you use like this special blue sponge right there. Oh. So okay. to make sure it doesn't hurt the glass. Wow. Okay, yeah, cool. then uh, applying this uh, coating agent yes. was much easier than I expect. Mm. Yeah. Is, yeah. is that really work for the heat, uh, blocking heat too? Yes, actually it does. So once you apply it for like maybe, I think the whole process takes about like one hour. Uh, the entire effect lasts you for like six months. And yes, in summer it will help to prevent your uh, engine or your, your actual car from heating up too much. Oh, wow, that's so, actually really yeah. cool. Because you know how you leave your car in an open space in summer mm -hmm. for a couple of hours, yep. then you come back later and you open the door and it's like, wow, it's yeah. an oven. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. That's the worst part. Yeah. Would you use this, do you think? Uh, after I tested it myself, and I'm pretty 100% <laughs> sure that this one really works, then I'm probably going to buy it and use it to my car. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. it's time for us to go to the lab and test it ourselves right here. Let's go. Okay. What happened? Oh! 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 oh. 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 Ah. Wow! Yeah. Wow! So we've heard enough about the good point of this coating agent. So. At the lab, what do you want to test the most? Well, John was so raving about its water repellence feature, mm -hmm. so I definitely want to see that, you know, ah. how that happened out, and does it really protect car from the water? I am also curious about that function. Yeah. Okay, let's test that right now. Since this coating agent needs to dry up after it's sprayed out, so we prepared a video for it. Let's see the video first. Okay, so it's, it's supposed to be really easy in use, right? It's supposed to be. Yeah, you just just spray it on. Simple uh -huh. spray. Yeah. For the car. Oh, so left. we have before and after, right? Uh, this left is, is after. Okay, left is after. Oh. Wow. Right is wow. Before. That's a big difference right there. Yeah. It is, yeah. Oh you just can tell. Mm. I wonder how it looks from inside. Because, you know, ah, when the you're visibility. actually... Yeah, the visibility. Oh, this is from the inside. inside. Wow. Look at that. Oh, my Whoa. God. Yeah. Can actually see where you're going. Exactly, yeah. Mm -hmm. What what is this? A brick? It's, it's a, a brick, brick. yeah, it's a brick. And left part is oh. out. Oh. oh my god. Oh my god, it doesn't stick at all. Look on the right it, side, it actually <laughs> sinks into the actual yeah, brick. It, it's get wet. Wow. But before that, look, it just repels it. Okay. Wow. Is... So this is fabric. Oh, oh wow. 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 No way. I need this so my dog doesn't pee on my carpet. Oh, absolutely. Oh, wow. I was thinking about just on a regular clothes. This looks you know, amazing. Oh, yeah. Not to get wet during the rain. Mm. Wow. So, oh any God. any that clothes so cool. will look turn at into that. a yeah. raincoat. Exactly. Wow, Whoa. that's so cool. So cool. Oh, you see? Oh. 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 Look at that. Oh. Yeah, it's 
Oh, okay. cool. Yeah. yeah. Even though it's a VCR, we still can tell what's the difference between before and after we do the coating things. Absolutely. So we prepared two pieces of paper, mm. which is a toilet paper. Okay. And this one is after we coat it, and this mm. one did not coat it. Okay. So, Amy, you want to try? Just dunk them both in? Yeah, <laughs> at the same time. Just do, be sure to make it at the same time. Right. So Just sing them both, mm -hmm. and then... Here one, we go. Three, two, one. one. Go! Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Wow. The regular Look paper it. is yeah. already Wait. teared down. It's still, it's okay. Wow. This is, this is like unbreakable. Wow. Ew, this wow. is just disgusting. Yeah. This is amazing. Let me try that more. Wow, it's still Wow, okay. this is really cool. This actually works. And, and it's wow. just a paper. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> waterproof paper. Oh, it's a waterproof <laughs> paper. That's, so that's amazing. amazing. Yeah, it's amazing. Yeah, Especially yeah. considering how yeah. thin paper is. Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah, it makes it's, it really I mean, difficult. it's just a paper, right? Mm. So if you use this spray to the cars or... Oh, absolutely. Mm. Wow. Yeah. Absolutely, yeah. it's waterproof. Exactly. Oh, yeah. So mm. the first water repelling test was successful. That's the product. It's holding another secret for you guys. Oh, okay. so, oh. so basically, on top of the water repellent feature, uh -huh. it also has a shock absorbing feature. Oh. So in addition to the water repellent, it really helps your car to protect itself from hail or other scratches. So it really minimizes the risk. Yeah, Let's wow. try that right yeah, now. Let's try that out. Yeah. Yeah. So we have a regular pen. Uh -huh. Let's see what damage we can do. Okay, just a pen that we can easily buy in any shop. Pretty okay. much. Mm. Okay. To vandalize a car with. Go, gangster, go! All right. Okay. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay, one, two, two three. three. Oh! Dude! Oh! oh. oh. Your, your hands okay? <laughs> yes. But uh, anyway. Uh, <laughs> Oh, it you doesn't... See, these <gasps> are the yeah. serious oh. scratches. <gasps> yeah. They are not coming off. Oh, if like, that really happens to my car, then I'm gonna find that guy. Mm. And do what to him? To... <laughs> to tell him to say sorry to me. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, sir, can you please apologize to me? <laughs> mm -hmm. And my car? <laughs> okay, so this is regular car and what it happens to, you know, in a regular world. Pretty yeah. serious stuff. Mm, yeah, it's terrible. But in the coated area, it will be different. Mm. Will it though? You want to try this time? No, I don't. Okay, I will try try this time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Let's see your gangster walk. You in. are the muscle of our lab, right? Yes. Okay, I'll do the. <laughs> this one is a coated area. We'll find out what's gonna be happen. What's gonna be different with that one? Put a little muscle yeah, in. Yeah, come on. on. No, this is a, you know, a, like, a man's mind that, you it's know, cars nothing. and cars. Precious car. <laughs> Give me that pen. Okay, you want to do it? No. I'll do it. Yeah. Put a scratch, okay? Yeah. One, two, three. It's marking, it's marking. <gasps> it's marking. Well, it is, but let's see what happens. Oh. 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 No. Whoa. That's amazing. <gasps> this is magic. Are you kidding me? Again, again, <laughs> again. <laughs> what? Whoa! Wow. Ah. wow, this is gorgeous. Unbelievable. Wow. Even, even though I did it myself. Cool. Wow. Okay. So as you can see, there's a protective um. layer that works as a magic barrier between car and any exterior item that could damage the car. That's amazing. Wow, that's amazing, yeah. That will save you so much money. You don't have to deal with this. Take, exactly. Save, save you some time exactly. as well. Exactly. It's money and time and thing. Mm. And money, of course, because yeah. mm. those are very expensive. Mm -hmm. That's right. Yeah. So the second test, shock protection test, is successful. Mm -hmm. 
this is a pretty hot bike, very mm. hot looking, <laughs> but I think we should also test the heat protection. Right. Oh yeah, absolutely. Because mm. you know, when you turn on the bike, it's getting heat up instantaneously. Mm. So mm. yeah, what we had to do is do the heat test. What I really wanted to bring the car here to test about how hot inside, mm. but since the car is too big for this studio, we prepared a motorcycle mm -hmm. instead of a car. But the temperature of the motorcycle goes up very high too. Absolutely, yes. right now. So the good thing about this product is mm. it works as well on motorcycles and on bicycles as well as on cars. Wow. So you don't, uh, you're not limited to the usage on cars only. Oh, okay. So if you look at the front of the motorcycle, there's mm -hmm. this part that is called the muffler. So the Here yeah, that part exactly. Mm -hmm. So the muffler is that part that actually suppresses the noise when the uh, engine is running. So basically it suppresses the engine sound and mm. the exhaust sound. Mm. Otherwise it would be just too loud. Right, yes. right. So in conclusion, it always heats up right away. So we used the coating agent to the muffler. As you see down there, right part is coated mm. and the left part is not coated. Mm. So we will start the engine shortly and then short after, we'll check the temperature of those two mufflers, if the temperature is different or not. So, okay, let's start the engine. Amy? Amy? Wow! wow. <laughs> that was a high kick to me. <laughs> Ready? Oh, wow, yeah. what a sound, what yeah. a sound. Get along with your bike. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, shall we test now about the temperature? Absolutely. Let's we can that. test uh, both pipe with this thermometer. Okay, as I said, the left part is not coated, which is... 122 degrees about. Ooh. And the right part is coated, which is wow. Wow. 84, what? 88, about that. Okay. Wow, it's a, huge, a huge difference. That's like a 30% difference, 40% difference right there. Yeah, it's a Great huge difference. Great calculation. Yeah. <laughs> wow. I definitely have to use this I to know. my car. All right, so yeah. heat protection it was very nice. Mm. Mm. So the third test, heat protection, was successful. Okay, now we have done with the thorough checks, uh, check and test for this product, and it was really good. Mm -hmm. So would you like to add any idea on this uh, coating agent? Well, um, the perfect agent, coating agent, the perfect product as it is, mm -hmm. I wouldn't sell it as a standalone product. I would definitely do the whole package thing, mm -hmm. you know, like kind of like package for your automobile and sell it like develop like with the uh, background of an app, like supporting with an app. Application, how will that be connected to this coating? Agent? Well, you can sell it through the application or you can ah. add some IoT features to the application to con actually control the thickness or the features of this wow. thing. Mm. Yeah, very futuristic. Okay. Uh, for me, I think uh, it's an amazing product. I'm really sold on this. And uh, I think you could use it for other things in the household. Ah. I would like to use it in my kitchen as mm. well or on my tablecloth. Mm -hmm. That way, like, when I just spray ketchup all over the place, <laughs> then it'll just fly right off. Oh, that's a Could I put idea. it on my clothes, too? I'm a pretty messy yeah. eater. I got, like, kimchi all over me. Ah, so nice. It just... <laughs> that's what I was just about to say, the clothing part. That's really good, yeah. actually. Mm. You know, like me, as a model, uh, I love to... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> me as a model... Uh. Blue steel. Uh. <laughs> as a former model. Okay. As a retired model, I would yes. say. <laughs> no, but uh, I think that's a great idea. So if it's not too harmful for the skin, it would be a great addition mm. to protecting your clothes in harsh weather, like a monsoon, monsoon oh. season right now, no, for example. Skin. Right. Yeah. No wrinkles. 
Oh, so far you can't use it to your human skin. <laughs> you only can use the car skins. Eco-friendly, mm. yes. Okay. <laughs> so we looked at a very fascinating car coating agent today. Uh, please summarize your opinion about this car coating agent in one sentence. Uh, yeah, to me, I think this is a very useful and effective product. It's kind of like the impenetrable guy. Mm. You know what I mean? It's like the guy that's so out of your league, he's always up there, you keep hitting on him and hitting on them and you never get anywhere impenetrable <laughs> make your car like that <laughs> okay what about you uh, for me it's a saving because mm. it's not just saving your money it's saving your time good mm -hmm. so John if you can summarize your opinion about this product Yes, actually, since I bought this product recently, mm. Mm. I've not gone to a single waxing session once. Mm. So that you can do it in your home. Absolutely, you can do everything at home now. That's very nice. Uh, if you're worrying about too expensive of washing cars or coating your cars, you probably can use this product in your home. So if there is any product too good to know yourself or any technology that has amazed you, please share with us at Prosumer Lab 101. We'll do a thorough check and test and answer all your questions. We'll see you next week with a new product. Meet new product that will change the world. Prosumer Lab 101. <laughs>